Hey, what's going on? This is Marcos. Today, I want to show you a new plugin for Final Cut Pro 10 that automatically normalizes your voice. So you just drop in this plugin into your video clips and it'll bring up the audio levels. Uh, so I'm going to show you how that works. So let's jump over to the computer. All right, so here we are in Final Cut Pro 10 and here's the video clip I recorded earlier with my voice is actually pretty low. If we play this. This is a test. My voice is pretty low right now. Now I'm going to pick it up. As you can see, um, it's coming in around negative 30 dB or just below that. And when I get loud, it goes to negative 20. So we want this loud enough that it peaks somewhere around negative six, negative three dB. Uh, that way when people play our videos on their phone, we're loud enough. We don't want to export a video that has a very low volume level. And also you don't want to do this, drag this up and down because you might clip your video clips if you just, you know, do this and, th and there's limitations to this. So I never touch this line. Let's keep it at zero. So we want, what we want to do is um, apply the level matic. Uh, here you can see, you go to the effects, scroll down and under crumple pop, or it might be under FX factory. You might find this uh, level matic once you, once you uh, download it um, from the internet. And let me show you. And to download it, you go to, uh, as you can see here, there'll be a link in the description, fxfactory.com, and the plugin is Levelmatic. Um, so let's go back and apply it, drop it into our video clip. We open it, and then the first thing we want to do is select on. Now bring the target up to, I would say, negative three, negative two, because we want to be loud enough. We don't want to clip the audio either, and this will take care of that. And then the uh, the strength we can go to up to 100 and we just play hit the space bar for playing this is a test my voice is pretty low right now now i'm going to pick it up and now i'm going to bring it back down and see how this new plugin levelizes our voice hopefully it does a good job as you can see here the new level is around negative 2 db it brought up the volume level for us and also you know when it Gets, when my voice got really loud, it didn't clip it. So let's see. This is Play a test. Again. My voice is pretty low right now. Now I'm going to pick it up and now I'm going to bring it back down and see how this new plugin levelizes our voice. Hopefully it does a good job. That's it. We just close it. Um, and yeah, if you look now at the audio levels on this side, uh, right hand side screen, as we play this, this is a test. My voice is pretty low right now. Now I'm going to pick it up and now I'm going to bring it back down and see how this new plugin levelizes our voice. Hopefully it does a good job. So you see it's no longer uh, sitting at negative uh, 30, negative 20. It brought up the it brought up the uh, volume level. So you no longer have to learn how to do a compressor and an, an adaptive limiter. You can just use this and you know, you can get your audio levels to a comfortable spot. So you can save this as a preset. You can, uh, I think this is a save button right here. Uh, what I do is just usually come in here and set the target to negative two, the strength to a hundred. If there's a lot of discrepancy between the loud, loudest part of your voice and the lowest. So, or you can just leave it to default 80 if there's not such a huge difference between your voice levels. Um, so that's what I would do. Um, so if you need more help with this, please drop your questions down below in the comment section. Also, there'll be a link to uh, Levelmatic if you want to check it out. Uh, another thing I want to mention, if you need more help with Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials, I have a masterclass. So make sure to check it out. Links in the description. As always, uh, thank you for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.